So I had to record this because I think I found something really weird. I was just hunting a Plesia in 3 Ultimate, as you can see there. It tried to jump out of the water, but I was hitting it. And it, like, landed back in the water. But, like, it's on a ledge. I don't know, it seems like it's stuck. Let's see if it stays stuck. Here it is. It's been, it's like here. It's like half on and half off the land. Oops, I shouldn't have got hit by that. Is it just stuck there? Like, it, it, I think it can't get out of there. I'm trying to see. I'm, let, let's tease it out. Yeah, well, oh, okay. It made it out. Hey y'all, this is me, after the fact, to explain what I didn't get to capture before I started recording. What happened is, uh, Plesioth jumped where it normally does when it jumps out of the water, and it landed like here, on the ledge, as if it was trying to land on the surface, but it landed like in back in the water. It was clipping through the uh, shoreline. And then um, it was started to do its uh, normal underwater attacks. It was underwater animations. And it seemed to be stuck in this region here that I've highlighted. Like, it couldn't go anywhere else. Um, I only caught the tail end of that in the video, but... Uh, yeah, this is a weird glitch. I don't know how to reproduce it, but I would love to do so if I can. And I've decided from here on out I'm going to just make sure I record every time that I hunt a Plesioth in the deserted islands. Or the Moga Woods, just in case something like this happens again. Probably won't, but that's what this video is for. So I'd love to hear if anybody knows what uh, exactly happened there, if they've seen this before. Uh, in the meantime, here's another little clip where I managed to bounce off the geometry at the same time that I hit Plezzy in the head. And then, of course, Plezzy punishes me for it. Okay, now it's confused. <laughs> I still don't understand why Plessy does that sometimes, but... Oh. 